Where I go, man, it's just like, <clears throat> basically like a lot of people, you know, from my neighborhood never leave my neighborhood where I grew up at, you know what I'm saying? They die on those same blocks, you know, never, there's motherfuckers I know who never been to Chicago, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And that's like, right there, you got right there, never been out of Detroit, you know, like never leave the hood either, you know what I'm saying? Like, out, don't go on 7 Mile and be... You know, don't know nothing about East 7 Mile or East 8 Mile or, you know what I'm saying? Don't know nothing about the East Side. You know, just stay, remain in that neighborhood. So I just wanted to, you know, you know, pinpoint shit like it's, it's, it's. Well, some Other people, places. you know, they got to stay like some people who live on the west side can't make it to the east side because the price of gas is so goddamn high <laughs> right now. You know what I'm saying? It takes yeah, tell 80, me about it. 80, 100 dollars just to go it. from the east side to the west side now. Hell yeah, you know? especially if you got premium, you putting premium in your man, shit. Thank God I got on, man. <laughs> <'Cause>, Hell yeah. <laughs> man. Like, you know what I'm saying? So it's like, you know, I wanted to just point out that, you know, it's, it's something more than just the neighborhood, you know what I mean? Yeah, definitely. So this is Everywhere I Go, featuring 50, Shape 4-5, Second Rounds on Me, Personal Preview Special, Album in Stores, August 15th. August 15th, oh, I'm yeah. there, you should be there, in the store, August 15th, buying a new Obi Trice album, why not? It's a great album, got some on there for you, appreciate that very much. Yeah. Buy two copies, buy three, buy four, even five even. He's talking, talking to you, son. I'm going. Yeah. Yeah. Clyde Ipe is real. That was everywhere I go. Featuring 50 Cent. Second oh, round's yeah. on me. Second round's off me. The new Obi Trice hour. Shout out to 50 Cent. August 15th. Shout out to 50, the whole G unit, Yayo Banks, Buck. You know what I'm saying? Um, uh, Spider Loke. You know, MOP. Hell yeah. Um, Mob Deep. Deep. You know everybody. what I'm saying? Everybody. everybody. Mace. Oh yeah, we got a big ass extended family, man. Yeah, I'm telling you, you really don't want to fuck with this camp. Yeah, it's so going down. This, this, the last track on the album, Obi Story. All right. I remember uh, you played this for sorry. me last time you were out here in New York, and mm -hmm. just the beat changing and the whole this. It starts out you think it's like, oh okay, this is his like, oh I'm going back in the day record. Right. Like, you know, you said talking about the worthy shit, and you know, it's like. <laughs> yeah. You, you caught up with that? Yeah. Oh, JR, JR produced that track. JR yeah. produced that track. He, yeah. he he put his foot in that. I mean, I, I all I did was just mix it, but we had to, you know, we had the skit too. We yeah. Put the skit in the beginning yeah. to, to, you know. Freak that. Take it back to when Obi was a kid. I'm gonna be fresh. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> little, little G, little Chew, son. Yeah, he did his thing. And then, you know, JR, you know, he played that shit on the piano. Like, he really played that shit. You know what I mean? Man, yeah, like it, he, it sounds like, you know, it's one of those records that sounds familiar. Like, the, the production sounds familiar. So that's, that's, and that's a good thing. Yeah. Cause you feel like it, you know, you take can. Take it back to something. Yeah, exactly. In your life, yeah. It's also one of them songs that you can you can honestly say that you get so caught up in the rap and what he's saying that it don't need a hook. You know what I'm saying? Oh, like yeah, it doesn't no need a, on it, huh? It no, doesn't. Just, you don't even notice it. Yeah, I didn't even it's think about it. It's just because of the the way the music changes and the way it, you know. What a way to end the album. You know what I mean? It's a perfect wrap up. It yeah. it, it, it says it all. Yeah. So let's get into this one. Produced by JR. This is Obi Story. Shape Four Five. Second rounds on me. Personal preview special. Album is Personal stores. Preview Special. <laughs> <laughs> album stores August 15th. Ah fuck! Shady Records, bitch. Four car today, baby. I'ma let you pick out whatever. Four five the hype is real. <laughs> Look, do we just have it on the board as Obi Story? It was just been on the board because we just call it that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's just like we'll, we'll put little working titles in, in. Yeah, working titles. Those will usually be. <laughs> they wind up sticking. They, they wind they up wind on the back of the album. Like, oh, this makes sense. Okay. Right. You know? You. That's crazy. So, Obi Story, that was it. So, you guys have heard the album. All our listeners out there. Second round's on me. The only thing left to do is wait. On August 14th at 11.55, yeah, it's better be at Tower Records, Virgin Records, yeah, that's Warehouse right. go, Music. Go cop it, man. Go at go midnight on shit. Monday, because this is that you've go heard it. The album's it. worth it. Go cop that motherfucker. Yeah, go cop Second it. Second round. Don't get me. it off the internet. The internet yeah, sucks. You. The internet is fucking up music right now, but the internet sucks because the quality of the music and all that shit, when you burn it off the, off of the internet right now, it's terrible. Yeah. You can't even, you can't even get, can't even get the, 
Yeah, it ain't gonna beat in your car. Like, there's some tracks on here, y'all, no joke. They pound, they like, they straight up bump in your system. Yeah, there's a lot of 808s going on and a lot of stuff that you're gonna miss if you go and cop it off the internet. Then like, a little, the, like a little beer. Then you get the inside sleeve, you can see the actual x-rays from when I was when I was shot earlier this year. You actually get to see how close it came. And you get you to know, see the pictures that Eminem drove. You get to see the pictures of Eminem drew. And you get to see, yeah, you, you get to see the bullet still lies in Obi's head. Yes, yeah. and you get wow. to see what I say about, about proof. You just get the motherfucker, man. You already know what it is. Shady Records, we always bring y'all great music, man. Stop playing. You already know what it is. Obi Trice is back, motherfucker. Off that little hiatus. This is the new album. It's in stores August 15th. Go cop it. You know, I guarantee you appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? You know what it is? Every time I remember when the Tupac record came out, I always went and bought it because I always knew it was going to be good. It's just like a Biggie album. You know what I'm saying? It's just like when you know that something's going to be good. So just go out and copy. You already know how we do it over here, man. Yo, those are, those are, Obi, those are real big words coming from M. Oh, yeah. Like, no that, like you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I know you understand that, but, yeah. like, as far as the people listening, to have some, to have Eminem say, "Yo, this album is like going to buy a Biggie album or a Pac album." Like those are those words yeah. right there. Like, and that's you could tell M's not saying you're not goofing off. He's not screaming and act, you know, acting funny right now. This is real talk. Like this album, you heard it. It was on. And if you didn't, if you didn't hear it front to back right now, we're gonna replay this again.